game, but not in nature. Raw emotion, real rivalry. It's an excellent recovery from the Watford defender. I think it's great from Kane, I've got to see. I think it gives him a little bit of a nudge. Now here comes Scotland. No flag as yet. England scrambling back and now the offside flag has gone up against Shea Adams. Yeah. Certainly looks offside. He's a good yard, doesn't he? Just goes a little bit early. Gay steps out. Port is coming across. He is excellent defending. He had to time it well and he did. In from Robertson in the end towards Porteous. Dunk got there first just. And England managed to get it away through Walker. I tell you, he did well there, Dunk, because I thought for a split second Porteous was getting in, in front of him. Rashford, Bellingham on the move. Foden in the centre and Kane. It's Walker! Quick and incisive from England. Bellingham with the outside of his foot to Walker. Kane's waiting. And Hendry in the way. It's brilliant defending, but it's also excellent play from England. This one touch stuff's fantastic because they know that Robertson and Tierney are out of position. So they switch it down the right hand side immediately. Jack Henry's position here for a centre back's excellent. Excellent. Bellingham. Rashford. It's Walker again, and it came off Phil Foden and into the back of the net. And England lead at Hampden. And Phil Foden has his fourth international goal. It's a great play, you know. Bellingham, his, his feet on the edge of the box, he's all composed, he's waiting for that pass, just slides it through. Marcus is on the side, Marcus just gets a shot. This is a shot, by the way. And Foden just finds his way into a dangerous area and just shuffles his feet about and, and gets a little and gets enough on it Ali doesn't he? Yeah definitely Portis steps out again but he doesn't play Rashford offside I need to tell you I think it's tremendous feat from Phil Foden to say Portis goes out to try and play Rashford offside he knows exactly exactly what he's doing here by the way look at that Rashford linking up with Foden Felix keeping it alive. Important moments here for Scotland, you sense. Bellingham. In from Foden. What a wicked delivery. Oh, and then the mistake by Robertson. And Jude Bellingham accepted the gift. And England have a second. Not a moment the Scotland captain will want to see again. But Jude Bellingham gets his second England goal. Can do absolutely everything. A lovely little check here. Chopsy, chopsy, chops. What a cross, by the way. That is so hard to defend. I think Robertson sees a pass. The pass is on. Within a split second, the pass is gone. He's got to clear his lines. He's got to clear his lines. Oh, he's just got to smash it. You cannot, Leon, you cannot turn and play into danger. He's playing right into danger. At the very least you do is open your body up and put it wide, get it out the other side. Yeah. Now can Scotland hit back with Tierney. Adams, and then away by Dunk. Big shot of Hamburg, I think. And the referee is delaying while they look at this. Yeah. It definitely hits his left hand, but it's not. It's not a penalty for me, I've got to say. I think he's falling, Ali, he's falling down, isn't yeah. he? Yeah, listen, it hits his hand, yes. Is it a penalty? No, not for me, no chance. Spot on with that Kyle Walker, isn't he? He just, oh. loves it, he? he just invites it down, he knows he's got the pace. I was watching it there, Dion, and uh, Keir Tierney had the ball, and he shaped his body <laughs> to take him on. And he thought, no, no. That's Christie again. From long range. That's a bit of intent. Never troubling the goalkeeper Ramsdale, but you know, as I mentioned again, he's looked lively. He should be hitting the target probably, but he certainly looked bright. Bellingham's made the run. Rashford's found him. Just 
Couldn't quite get the angle for the cross. And it was just as well because Kane had found himself a little bit of space in the box and Phil Foden was supporting at the same time. Again, an opportunity. Got a good connection, those two, you know, Bellingham and Rashford. Nice little connection, the two of them. Here's McGinn. Robertson in an advanced position on the right-hand side. Oh, and it's an own goal. And Scotland the back in it. It's Harry Maguire to put through his own net and pass Ramsdale. And the deficit has been reduced. Steve Clark's team have their reward at 2-1. Well, I'm going to tell you something. It seemed to be the only way that Scotland when they get a goal, a defensive mix-up. I mean, Maguire sticks out his left foot. You can argue he's unlucky, but he takes it completely away from Ramsdale. It's just a lack of communication. You've got to give Robertson credit. He was wholly responsible for the second England goal. He finds himself in an alien position now, the right-hand side. And boy, does he, all he does, he puts a delivery into the box and he asks a question and he earns his little bit of luck. Saka and Eze are the England replacements the next time the ball goes out of play. Here's the Scotland captain, Robertson. What a great delivery. And that is an opportunity for John McGinn. Oh, it's a big opportunity. The delivery ends first class. It really is from Robertson. He comes across. It's excellent. He makes a brilliant diagonal run. Does he come off his shoulder? He gets in front of Dunk. You're right, spot on. He's got to get a head on it and hit the target. Comes off John McGinn's shoulder. No danger for the goalkeeper, but miles better from Scotland. Miles better. A super ball into Eze if he can take it in his stride. A real opportunity denied by Gunn. Almost came to Kane and away by Angus Gunn again. What a touch from Eze. I mean, I don't know what Hickey's doing. I think it's Hickey in the right hand side. Let him get inside him. But the touch is fantastic and he should be scoring. The goalkeeper makes a wonderful save and keeps Scotland in the game. Bellingham skips away from two. He's still going here, Jude Bellingham! Denied by Gunn. But in full flowy sunshine. Do you know what he's done three or four times? He's brilliant at He opens his body up, he's going to whip it in with his right foot and goes back onto his left. There, that one there. Beautiful movement, beautiful movement. Bellingham. Wriggles away from Christie. Then finds Harry Kane! And England do have their two-goal advantage back. Kane the scorer, but Bellingham the provider. 8 in 8 England games for Harry Kane. That's just quality. That's just pure quality. Bellingham and the weight of pass and the fake to shoot, and then he just steers his, his skipper in. It's just great. So he's under severe pressure here. Look at that. Then he goes to shoot and then he just steers his skipper in and what do you expect from Harry Kane? He puts it away incredibly, that's, that's patient play. That's going back to what they were doing in the first half. Brilliant, brilliant football all round for me. Listen, I'll tell you right now, it's a magnificent goal.